Yo, yo, everyone. Uh, so, brief update video. I wanted to throw out some news just so people would know. Um, I'll go ahead and do it all at the beginning of the video and then explain it all later. Um, but just some talking points. Uh, well, first off, I am now a PhD candidate. Um, I The reason I haven't been posting videos in the past month or so is I had a bunch of stuff to do. I had an oral defense. I just had a bunch of different assignments and presentations and just different stuff. That's why I haven't been posting recently. Um, but I, I'll still be active on the forum or Twitter or whatever, or however active I usually am. Um, but I'm going to be making, now, now most of it is sort of beyond me, or past me or whatever. Um, so I'm going to be putting up more videos now, just so you know, I'm, I'm still here. Um, so news entries, I'll go ahead and mention them all right now. First off, got my X220 back. It is working actually better than new. It's better than it was before. I'll talk about that in a second. Um, second off, I'm going to be presenting at Linux Fest Southeast, for those of you who are in the southeast of the United States or somewhere else around there. Um, also, uh, let's see, oh, a couple videos I want to talk about in a second, and, um, yeah, there's probably something else. I, th I think I had another thing, but whatever. Um, so anyway, on the X220, uh, a month or so ago, I, I mentioned that, uh, you know, I was repairing this thing, and, uh, I forgot to unplug it at some period, and it fried, it fried the screen connector between the motherboard and the screen. Um, and, you know, I put up a video like, ah, pff, I'm just going to use my X200, I'll, I'll think about this later. Um, now, I get a bunch of emails from people. One of them was from Tripcode, who's another YouTuber who I mentioned in one of my last videos, and he volunteered basically to just repair it. Um, so I'll give you a link to the video where he actually repaired it, but I send it off, sent it off to him, uh, and I, he replaced the motherboard. I think he replaced the screen as well. I, I think he had a lot of these pieces lying around, but he might have, I, th I think he actually bought might have bought a new motherboard. So anyway, thanks to him a lot. Um, uh, and so he repaired it. And not just that, um, when he fixed everything, I think he got some kind of motherboard error or something like that. Nothing fatal, just something you have to click through. Um, but he asked me, hey, you want me to, to just flash core boot on it? And I was like, well, okay, sure. Um, so this thing now actually has core boot on it. Um, so that, that's really nice. So it's better than it was before, so to speak. Um, there, there are actually still some things I think we're figuring it out, but uh, yeah, mostly it's 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 fantastic, uh, works great, uh, and it's nice to have the computer back again. Actually, it's really it's like a Theseus's ship kind of thing. Is like, it has a new screen, has a new motherboard. Is it really the same computer? Hmm. Uh, it still has this one screw on the bottom that doesn't screw in right, so I guess that makes makes it the same computer. Um, so anyway, that is that. Um, so with respect to Linux Fest, as I said, I'm going to be presenting, uh, where is it? Um, it's Charlotte, North Carolina, uh, June 8th to the 10th. Um, so I'm going to be out there. Uh, if any of you guys are in the southeast, you should definitely come, or a little further away, of course, you're welcome to come. I forget if there's a, a, a um, participation fee. I don't think there is, uh, but there might be. I, I don't want to I don't want to say. They do have a bunch of sponsors, so I don't think so. See, I'm used to all these academic conferences where a lot of lower tier ones will, like, ask you to pay money or something like that. But anyway, so I'm going to be talking there. I'm, I forget my exact talk topic, but it was something on software minimalism and how people should basically embrace it. Uh, and I think that the, the time slots they give, again, another thing from academic conferences, I'm used to presenting in like 20 minute time slots. I think they're giving me an hour or something like that. They give everyone an hour, or at least they did in previous years. So that's going to happen. Um, so yeah, I, I, in my personal life, I'm moving back to the Southeast, and that's one of the reasons I'm presenting at the Southeast one, just so you know. Um, and let's see if there's anything else. Now, there's probably something else that I, I meant to say, but um, that's basically it. Uh, long story short is, uh, in the next couple days, I'm going to be putting out a lot of video. Well, I don't want to say a lot, but I want to put out one every other day or one every day, depending on how much work I can get done. Um, so one of the ones that I'm going to be putting up pretty soon is a promised video from, I think I promised it like a month ago and I haven't done it. Um, and that is, in fact, I promised it on Patreon, which, you know, should, I should definitely do it. And it's just a bunch of personal reasons I couldn't. Uh, but that's going to be a video configuring a, a fresh install of Arch Linux. Uh, so I'm going to do that. I have it like 90% prepared. I just never had the chance, since I lost the ThinkPad temporarily, I didn't have the chance to actually uh, record it and do some other stuff that I needed it for. Uh, but now I'll be able to do that. And there are a couple other videos, uh, actually sort of interesting ones that I'm going to have coming out soon. Uh, I don't know if I, I I don't know if I want to say they're a little different, but uh, we'll we'll figure it out. Um, so anyway, that's about it. I gotta go. Uh, I'm actually I have to get somewhere. I gotta gotta go cook this ham. 
Um, so I'll see you guys uh, pretty soon. I'll probably put up a video in the next couple days whenever you're seeing this. So uh, have a good one and I'll see you next time.